I would say that he's very, he's very joyful. He's really a character. He's very unique and it's hard to describe to people before they meet him quite, quite what his personality entails. He's wise beyond his years in many ways. Very fun, outgoing, and just a joy to be around. If you have to have the medical complexity, gosh, we're so lucky he has the, that easy, warm, happy temperament. So Noah has Vactoral, which is a complex bunch of different um, congenital anomalies that he was born with that necessitated surgeries right from birth. The minute he was born, he had to go for his sur first surgeries. He had so many tubes, we weren't able to hold them. He's had numerous spine surgeries. Because he's had to have more than one, he has a lot of scar tissue in the base of his spine, and that has resulted in kind of chronic pain. One of the things that's the hardest for me and probably for Amy is that I think Noah lives with pain every day. When something's wrong for him, like, and he knows that something's gonna be hard and it makes like his mom upset, he will say, Amy, Amy, it's okay. It's gonna be fine. He's just that type of, of kid. Hey guys! Hi everybody! <laughs> my nurses fight to be, to be the one to have my schedule for the day if Noah's coming in so that they can be the one to work him up and talk to him. And again, they'll get as much out of him as he will from them. <laughs> Noah's become special in my life. I've grown to know not only Noah, but his family, and they're the reason that my job makes me so happy. He's a pillar of resilience and strength during this really hard time. He really can be such an example to other, other patients of ways that you can do this in a strong, positive way. It's impossible to think that we could go to the hospital without the child life staff. They make all of the procedures and longer appointments that Noah has really tolerable. We do an amazing job with the medical side. I mean, we are an incredible facility for that. But I also think we flourish because of what we do with patient and family centered care. We couldn't live here, we certainly couldn't own a business in this community if we didn't have such high quality care right in our backyard. We're also really thankful for the coordination of our care team, and that is part of what makes it such good care, that they try to discuss and make decisions related to what would be the best outcome for Noah and what would be the best outcome for our family. Family is an extension of the patient, and you are there working not for them, but with them. It's, it's nice to know that you have such a support network behind you, and when you need help and you ask for help, it's, it's there.